way, right where you want. for an opportunity like that and that was freaking opening day that was a big ball dude that was something you never almost never seen Washington man I knew there had to be one in here, dude. That thing is massive. That thing is massive. Alright, right now it's maybe 5.30. My cousin and I, we got back to the water around, around 3, basically fell asleep, I fell asleep, but I, I was basically running on two, two to three hours of sleep today, so when we sat there, I just naturally fell asleep, and when I woke up, my cousin was gone, <laughs> so I was like, what the heck, did I just get ditched, so I think I heard him bugling down over here somewhere, so I, I slowly worked my way down, just cow calling, and bugling so I, I don't know exactly where he is just gonna stay here maybe listen to try and locate some bowls as it's getting dark so who knows he might get lucky hopefully that guy shows up again alright guys so my cousin and I we were coming back to the car my first shot was a money shot at the, and then she just slowly walked off into like a, we, we saw where, we saw where she bed. I think we're gonna be okay. I think my first elk, I think I'm about to kill my first elk. All right guys, it might be a little dark, but I feel like I did good shots, so we're gonna slowly go and track her blood. I think she, she's not down far, so let's go. so far this is about 100 yards from where I shot her so we'll see what happens 
Alright guys, went from one of the highest of highs to not the lowest of those, but definitely back to kind of normal. Tractor for about 80 yards. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to town and we're going to go buy some water. So it's getting pretty late out. You guys see that? If I turn off the flashlight, you guys can't see me. So we're probably going to go back to town. We've got to get to the car first. Go back to town. And then maybe it will probably take us like maybe two hours. And then maybe in two hours, hopefully she'll be expired by then because I don't want to keep pushing her. But we have good blood, so I'm confident that she's down. Like, my first shot, I'm pretty sure it was money. A little low, just a tad low. And I, I got, I, I'm pretty sure I got two arrows in her afterwards because she never ran. I think she got hurt, so she wasn't able to run. So, like, like for my, my model is if it's not down, I keep shooting. So, a lot of people don't like that, but to me, I'd rather have a three arrows and a dead elk than one, one arrow and an elk that's still alive. So, we're going to go back to the car. Then we're going to drive on to town and buy some water and we'll be back. Keep you guys updated, guys. So, my cousin's gonna back up the truck, but I just have to talk to you guys real quick. We're about to go and track her, but this anticipation is really killing me. I guess it's just one of those things you have to do when you bow hunt, right? Anticipation is really killing me right now. It's been about three hours, three and a half hours since the last shot. So, hopefully, she's down. Alright, guys, here we go. So, we just left the car. We gotta go back to where we marked. The blood where we last saw it and then we'll start from there but for now we gotta work our way to the blood trail all right guys we are on the trail we have... you guys I can't describe my emotions right now but we are hot on our trail she go over there One right here. Wait. Okay, right here. Yeah, like I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. So she, so that's probably where she's back there. Yep, right there. Guys, elk down, baby! Oh my goodness! That thing's huge! Oh bro. my gosh, she's way bigger than I thought. <laughs> Guys! Elk down, first elk, baby. Dude, she was dead earlier, bro. That's dude. She yeah, she's kind of frozen already. Elk down, baby. Elk down. Yep, we did it. Way to go, dude. <laughs> Thanks for everything, man. Oh, it's all good, man. Come the go. hard work starts here, but we gotta take some pictures. Yep. Oh my goodness, guys, that's crazy. My cousin was <laughs> joking with me so much. He's like, it's right there. So when when he said it right there, I was like, quit lying. <laughs> and he looked at that dude. That's insane. I gotta let the family know. <laughs> Dear Heavenly Father, I think I just wanna give you my biggest thank you of all time, Lord. Uh, you know, I shot this cow earlier and you know, my, my heart was pounding all over and we successfully recovered it, Lord. I, I'm glad that this elk didn't suffer as, as long as I thought she would, but everything, I, I pray that it glorifies your name and that this animal right here will feed our family, Lord. And everything we do, it glorifies your name, Lord. Alright guys, so before we start everything, try to do this so you guys can see. What I'm doing right now is I am gonna notch my first ever elk tag in my life. This is my first elk, man. I've never shot an elk before. And thanks, man. So, all right, we have my black bear tag out right here, right here. So we shot it, what's today though? All right, so today is Thursday, September 14th, 2017. And so, we're gonna go to September. September and 14th, I get. There you go, guys. My first ever notch tag, September 14th, right there. Tagged out, baby.